Okay, hello everyone, and welcome to another edition of First Second Sketch School. My name is Jo Ryu, I'm an author and illustrator of graphic novels, and today I'm here to share with you my latest graphic novel, Cat's Cradle, The Golden Twine. It's a story about monsters, a mystery, a magic, and finding your true home. And I really liked working with the colors in this book, especially. I got to go really lush and vibrant, and there's a lot of spooky night scenes, so I got to play with that. And today, I'd like to show you a step-by-step -step process of how I draw my main character, Suri, who you see on the cover here. So let's go ahead and get started. If you want to follow along, you can just use a regular pencil. I'll be using Colorace pencils in terracotta and black, as well as a Prismacolor Premier pen in size 01. I'll put the names of the materials in the video description. I'm going to start by drawing a circle. Not too precise. And then I'll use a technique called the face cross. That's just putting a cross in the middle of the face. So I put a nose line and an eye line, and that'll help me build my character. Then I'll start with the important features, like the nose. I like to start with the nose or the eyes. Siri has a tiny nose, a little turned up. And the eyes are big and the outer corners are a little higher than the inner ones. make the irises pretty big in the eye itself. I find it gives them, gives my characters a very friendly look. And then the mouth. I'm gonna give Siri a nice big smile because she's an optimist. Then for the face shape. I'm not going to follow the circle exactly because Siri has a bit more of a, a squarish face. There. And I always give my characters pretty good foreheads and good chins too. And then for my favorite part, the hair. Siri has fun hair to draw because it's, it's wild, it's messy, it's big. She has these two locks uh, that frame her face. Don't forget her kerchief. Now for the hair, I do big fluffy waves. Uh, I don't mind about being messy. good initial sketch. Now I'm ready to move on to the black coal race. Whenever I switch to a new part of my process, I'll usually pick an area that, you know, it doesn't matter if my lines are, are not quite right, like the hair, just so I, get, I can get comfortable before I move into the important parts, like the features of the face.
Okay, and now I'm ready to go to the ink stage, which is probably my favorite stage, because that's when the drawing suddenly comes to life. Again, I was starting with an area where I don't mind if my lines are a little wobbly. Just warming up. So much of making comics is about practice. And the last finishing touches that I do for all my characters is I give them a little bit of blush on the cheeks and on the nose and on the chin. And now I can erase my lines, my guidelines. And there you have it. Thank you so much for joining me for another First Second Sketch School. Please check out my graphic novel, Cat's Cradle, The Golden Twine, for a spooky, fun monster adventure. And until next time, take care.